Gentlemen, gentlemen, as chairman of this congressional committee, I wish to thank Colonel Plummer and his staff for this pleasant and educational luncheon. Now, duty calls. If, uh, if you gentlemen and Miss Frost will just go along with Lieutenant Lee here, he has arranged a tour of the area for you. Well, thank you very much. Right this way, please. Oh. Visiting congressman. Why aren't they out somewhere investigating a crap game? Colonel Plummer. What the dip? Oh, it's you, Miss Frost. Well, you'd better run along, or you'll miss the tour. For an eye of a woman, a guided tour is like a man with an apartment. They both want to take you where you don't want to go. Uh, just what is it you want, Miss Frost? Colonel Plummer, driving over here on the streets of Berlin, I was shocked to see American soldiers walk right up and speak to German women without an introduction. Well, heavens to Betsy. <laughs> this is a serious matter. What do you intend to do? Personally investigate the morals of the whole United States Army? I haven't got the strength. I couldn't possibly. Colonel Plummer, you've given me an idea. Oh, now, wait a minute, please. For the honor and glory of the United States, I am going out and get myself picked up. <laughs> Fine den of vice this city is. Girl walks her feet off and she can't even get into trouble. Hey, Fraulein! I'm a moment, Fraulein! Oh, golly. Two of them. What do I do now? Uh, mix those snow, Fraulein. Hold on a minute, will you? Hey, look her over, Joe. A very tasty dish. <laughs> uh, guten afternoon, Fraulein. <laughs> oh, uh... Hiya, Strudel. <laughs> hey, she won't talk, Mike. Maybe she don't like G.I.s. What do you mean, maybe she don't like G.I.s? Show her a candy bar. Jock. Get that jock. Hey, hey Fraulein, you like a little Thompson mocking? A Lorelei cabaret, huh? Jock. <laughs> What's the matter with her? Jock. Oh, this kid kills me. All she can say is ja. That's bad. <laughs> uh, Fraulein, what is your name? Ja. <laughs> no, 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 no. Your name? Gretchen. Gretchen what? Gretchen Gesundheit. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like that? We're fraternizing with a sneeze. <laughs> She's a dope. Here comes the champagne. Now put it right here, waiter. How do you like these bandits? Cost us five packs of cigarettes for a lousy bottle of wine. Yeah. Dice is Ina Kleiner clip joint. <laughs> hey, you, know, you, you know what Germany needs? More cigarettes for you and me. Maybe we ought to write them donut heads in Congress. Why, you... What did you say, Strudel? Ja. And a girl with a vocabulary like that, you could run for Congress yourself back home. Hey. Hey, go. Get a load of that. Hey, that is strudel a la mode. Want to buy some illusion? Slightly you. Second hand They were lovely illusions Reaching high Built on sand They had a touch of paradise A spell you can't explain For in this crazy paradise You are in love with 
want to buy some illusion slightly you just like new such romantic illusion and they're all about you I'll sell them all for a penny they make pretty Take my lovely illusion Some for love Some for tears Erica Erica Johnny Come here, behind this pillar What's the matter, Johnny? Look over there, that woman. Oh, yes, she looks very sad. So does a bloodhound, but it bites. Now, let's stay out of sight. I don't want her to see me. Hey, Mike, that's the kind of pastry makes you drool on your bib. You know, they say she was right up there with them major league Nazis, a Gabbles girl or a Gary, one of them anyway. How did she get away with it? Ah, she hooked herself up with some big army brat. Hey, you supposed to swing it and dance? Come on, Gretchen. Uh, how's Mr. Kleiner Tant smocking, eh? <laughs> Come on, Gretchen. Loosen up. Don't you know how to dance? That cake. What? What'd you say? That's the cake I brought from Iowa. The cake on the table. Gretchen, what are you saying? Let go of me, you big ape. I happen to be a congresswoman of the United States. Oh, brother, let me out of here. <laughs> this cake? Where did this cake come from? Well, there it is. My birthday present. This cake is confiscated. Oh, Captain Pringle. So, this is what happened to my cake. What do you know about this? Well, it was stolen from my Jeep in the Brandenburg Gate area, Miss Frost. Oh. You know, the black market? Yes. I traced the cake here, but don't you trouble yourself, Miss Frost. You just... Oh, no, no, no. Where is my notebook? There, now. What exactly is the name of this rat trap? Why, uh, the, uh, Lorelei. The Lorelei. And what is the name of that woman? Woman? What woman? The singer here. Oh, oh, that woman. Well, uh, let me see now if I can place her. I think it's, um, uh, um, uh, Erica. Something like that. Erica what? Uh, Erica, uh, uh, von Schluto. How do you spell it? With an umlaut. <laughs> <laughs> I thought so. Okay. Even her name is subversive. <laughs> That's why I ask you to this conference. When we moved into Germany, we found a country of open graves and closed hearts. We've tried to turn it into a civilized state. It's a tough, thankless, lonely job. Oh, sure, sure, some of us get out of line occasionally. But, but remember this. For the first time in history, you're asking the same generation of soldiers to be both valorous and wise. Well, as chairman of this committee, Colonel, let me tell you we understand. Yes, sir, we certainly do. I don't. What? I know, Miss Foss. You're from Iowa. What about the G.I.s consorting with Fraulein's in wide-open, shameless, black-market nightclubs? Dives where they serve bootleg birthday cake? What about a strudel named Erica von Schluto who works, if that is the word for it, at a dive called the Lorelei? How can uh, I... Pardon me, please. Did you say Erica von Schluter? I did. I'm sorry, but I must ask you to drop this particular matter. Ha! You're hiding something, Colonel Plummer. There are some things which must be left to the discretion of the military. The last time someone tried to gag me, Colonel, he tried it with a mink coat in the middle of winter. I'd just like you to know, he got five years and I got pneumonia. 